Hello friends, welcome to my tutorial in relation with teach you on how to configure link aggregation or LACP in FortiCAD Firewall. So in this scenario, I have combined two ports, first LACP, first LACP A1 link aggregation, port 2 and port 3 on FortiCAD. So to do this, first you need to go to your FortiCAD and then you go to network. Okay. And then you have to create interface. You go to interface. This one I will put LACP. Okay. LACP. For example, LACP start. Okay. I will put the same name, alias. And this time I will choose this one, aggregate. And then here is the joining port. So us uh, uh, in this scenario, we will combine port 2 and port 3 as our uh, aggregate, okay, port 3 and port 4. So when one port is down, another port will take over this one. And then I will give my end role, I want this one is LAN, because I want to fun configure this one as our uh, LAN. And then you can put your IP, okay, I can put my IP. I will put my IP like this, the LAN IP. Oh, sorry. This one, because of this IP I have used, so I will delete it. I will reuse another ring I want. Okay. Okay, 20 as my land, and then you have to apply the HP server. I will from uh, 100, okay, to 24. Okay, like before this one, you can the same as our IP and the same as our DNS. If you want to specify, you can put also here. And if you want to specify, you can also put your DNS here. So I don't. I will specify uh, the system DNS. This one I will teach on. Okay. Then enable. Okay. Okay. So the link has been uh, combined. So we have port three and port four. Okay. And uh, for those when you combine port and this one is down, okay, just in case a one down, so you need to log in your FortiCAD firewall in CLI like this, okay. Just in case your port is down a one, you have to add another or uh, end the uh, LSP mode to start it. So you just go to like. There no net link aggregate list. Okay, so it will show all the your LACP. This one I have created, and this one I have created for testing. What we need to need, what we need to do if we uh, need to um, config the interface if it's not working, and then you choose edit, edit on. LACP, the name of your aggregate stuff. Okay, here is the name that we just created. Okay, and then you want to see so cool configuration. We want to see all the configuration of our LACP. Okay, this one uh, I will be specify more in the next lesson about this one, or you can explore more. Okay. It will be has more at one when you enter. Okay. A lot. See? 
so what you need to do you need to accept a a cp mode static everyone mode static okay and then just add it okay this one i just tell you just in case this one is down when you combine it okay so after you combine it another step that you need to do you need to allow this uh, port or allow this lcp to internet so you just go to here policy and object firewall and then you need to create the policy i will report internet internet stuff and then incoming interface is our LCP that we just created. And then our coming to when port. Okay. Source. Okay. Source is one. For your organization, you have to specify which, which LAN or which VLAN that you need to uh, allow your client to access. So this one, I will leave it all. Okay. For demo, I will leave it all. Okay. This one. All. Okay. okay and then just okay it okay so after we already created let's go back to our client we check if our client already get the IP, IP config slash release, IP config slash release, and then in you, okay. You see now it can be access the internet as you can see. I want to pay IP config slash all. Here is the IP address that I get, 2100. We can fix that all. Okay. Ping A A A. Okay, you see it can be accessed. So this client received the IP address of our uh LACP port or link aggregation port. Or let's say if one port is down, okay. I will remove one port. That's mean that this port is down. Okay, I will remove port four. Okay, that's mean port four is down. Then we go back to our client. If the client still get IP and internet access, <coughs> I will plus release and renew again. Okay, release, renew. Let's see. You see? So even those uh, one port was visible or have the problem like broken or down so another port will be uh, taken over okay so for uh, today lesson is all i hope that you find this lesson useful see you in the next video bye bye